Welcome to Web 801, where we turn brochure websites into sales machines. In today's video, we're going to talk about how to edit office hours and also reviews in Google My Business. So first we'll get to the Google My Business page and we'll go down to info and we'll click that. The special hours is here and the regular hours is here. We're going to edit the special hours, but let's look at the regular hours. I click that button and this shows all the regular hours. I'll click cancel. Now I'll go to the special hours. And here I can see other special hours we've created. And I'm going to click on the date and then go to the specific date I want to edit, which is this Saturday. And that date will appear. And then I can click open and then I can put in the hours. In this case, it's 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. And then I can go down to the bottom and click apply. Now you'll see down below, it'll show under review. And I can edit this by clicking here and then changing the time and clicking apply. Now we'll do a quick review. So I'll click info. I will go to the special hours. I'll click on the date. I'll select the date I want to change to. I'll click open and I'll put in the date or the, I'll put in the time and I can just type that in. So in this case, 10 o'clock to three o'clock PM. And then I'll click apply. And you'll see there it is under review. The next thing we're going to talk about is how to reply to reviews. So we'll go to reviews and then you'll see all of these different reviews. It's recommended that we reply to all of them if, if we can. At least a thank you for your review or whatever. But in this case, to make it quicker, we'll go to replied and then haven't replied. And then we can scroll down on those. And what I'm looking for in this case are reviews that aren't great. So this one's a two out of five stars. You can see what they're saying here. So I can click reply. I can type in something and then click post reply. And if I wanted to edit this, I could always come back and click edit. And then I can scroll down. I see that one has two stars as well, but it doesn't have a description. So I'll probably just leave that one as it is. Thanks so much for watching the video today. If you like this, please give it a thumbs up or make a comment below. And also subscribe to our channel if you want to see more videos like this. I'm Nate from Web801, where we turn brochure websites into sales machines.